Hi everybody, welcome back. Um, today we're going to be doing an unboxing video. Haven't done one of those in a in a minute. Not that I haven't bought in anything. I just I just never filmed it, but I can assure you I've bought stuff, as you can tell from my wardrobe tour. But um, we have an OP. Um, we also have a bag. And we have a Baby the Starshine Bright order, which is fitting in a box this size, which I'm not really sure how that's going to go. I mean, it technically makes sense, but I guess we'll find out. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. My hair is staticky because it's so dry where I live because it's winter, but yeah. Let's go into the OP first. If I can find a way to open this. Maybe I don't even have to, maybe I just like rip it open. I don't know. I'm really bad at opening boxes. Oh yeah, okay. Yay. Oh, this is the bag, not the book, not the OP. Okay. It says, thank you, hope you enjoy the bag. This is really sweet, it's on a little My Melody. That's really cute. I always appreciate it when people write on cute paper. I try to do it too. Um, here's the bag. Oh, they wrapped it very nicely too. Wow, it's so well wrapped. Okay, so this is the bag. It's a Baby the Starshine Bright bag. I'm so excited to own this. It has a little bit of damage, but not really anything that insane. There's like some marks right here. Um, it's obviously like used. It doesn't have like flaking though or anything like that. It's just like, you know, it's creased a little bit cause it's been used. And I think this is from 2006. So it's an older bag you know, for Lolita standards, um, especially the fact that it's a baby, the Starshine Bright bag, um, from that long ago in general, or just in general, that it's from baby and it hasn't flaked. So I'm pretty confident that this won't flake, hopefully, because it's older. And from what I've seen, even like older bags that were stored properly, or like not even just older bags, but like new bags that are stored properly flake a lot. So that's the main reason why I haven't bought any like brand new bags. Cause I totally would have bought like the heart bags or um, the only one that I've seen that doesn't seem to flake just, just by looking at listings. I mean, if you own one and it's flaked quite a bit, please let me know. But those crown, um, I don't know what they call them but they're like crown purses i'll put it on the screen but yeah i'd like to own one of those too but oh backwards <laughs> this bag is so cute it's actually supposed to be like a winter themed bag which i didn't even realize when i saw the listing initially it's only until i looked on the lolly that i that it's like it's called like the snow polka dot bag or something like that um but it does have a little um snowflake on it so, uh, the, and I was like, that's cute because it's like, this is a little snow piles and the polka dots are like the snow falling down. Um, but, and I was like, you know, who cares if I'm going to wear this in the summertime because no one will even notice the snowflake. And I was also kind of thinking about putting like key, like keychains that are soft, you know, that's not going to scrape the bag up and like, it'd probably cover that anyways, but who's going to even notice from far? I didn't even notice on the listing. So, um, so yeah, I'm happy with this and I love the metal like um, strap things. I love that. I've, I've always wanted a baby bag like this and I got it for a pretty decent price. And um, yeah, it doesn't come with the original um, straps. So that is a bit of a downer, but it's okay because I just figured I could use my Usakumiya straps because it matches pretty decently with it. And they're nice straps, so let's just put it on to see what it looks like. There's just been so many cute things recently, and it's really coming from my wallet. So it's been a struggle, and I'm trying to sell some stuff. 
Like, I'm pretty sure I'm going to sell the... The JSK I'm wearing today, I paired it with this belt, which is, comes from my Jane Marple um, skirt that I have. But I think I'm probably going to sell this because I just don't really like the cut on me. Um, and I think I could find something more fitting to me, like something I care more about for like the same price. So, oh, I flipped it upside down by doing that. Okay. Well, this is it with the Usakumiya um, strap. I think that works pretty decently for right now. I could always just order a black strap. I don't know why it keeps turning upside down. I must have put it on kind of curled. That's my own doing, but I'll fix that. <laughs> this was just to test it out. But I think it looks pretty cute, actually, with the white strap because it like matches the white accents but yeah i'm really happy to have this it's awesome to have a bag that like fits a bunch of stuff too this is the inside it has a little baby logo and it has like a little place for your wallet or your phone so it's really nice i'm very happy very happy to own this and i'll make sure to like stuff it i don't know if that's actually good or not i have to look more into like caring for these types of bags but i would imagine like stuffing it so that it doesn't like wrinkle and stay that way forever would be best but yeah thank you to the seller that i bought this from very nice wrapping and everything and they're very kind all my all the sellers i interact with are very kind so i'm very lucky okay now let's go into the op like what i originally planned because the op and this bag should match like pretty decently not that it really matters too much but um, because I would use them either way, but I was just really excited because I was like, these are perfect for each other. And, um, I paid a, well, I, I would say I paid a decent amount of money for this in the terms of, like, for my, for what I usually like to pay for Lolita. But really, it's like the middle ground. And I mean, it was a bidding, but I just bought it <laughs> as I saw it. I was I just paid for the buy now price, so I am not complaining at all. And it's it's worth it to me. This is wrapped up too, pretty good. I was surprised when I got these packages on my porch. Um, oh, thank you to the postal service for bringing all three of them because like. I didn't expect them to deliver, like they were supposed to all deliver at the same time, but I just didn't expect it. Cause usually I always like, I'll get something weird, like where it won't match up or something, or they'll like not be able to actually deliver it on time. But yeah, okay, I already love it so much. There were, the pictures like were, were fine, but um, it's even better in person. <laughs> so I got this, obviously it's wrinkled, but it was in transit. Um, I got this Maximum, um, OP. Maximum, it's such an I iconic tag. And it's pink and black. You see, even, even on camera right now, you can't tell, like, it's a lot more vibrant. It's not vibrant in a way of, like, it's too saturated. It's just, like... It looks even more pink because at first i was like i thought it was just the lighting and it was white or something but i've been saying i really want to do pink and black in my wardrobe um so this was like perfect and it matches this like perfectly like that's so cute i can't wait to like pair that together but yeah so they have detachable um sleeves so cute the details are so adorable they're like hearts and clubs on the lace and this lace is also really pretty. I think this is from 2003. I can't remember. I, we couldn't find the actual Lollyberry listing. I might ask, I might ask like somebody if, who knows more about this stuff um, if they know the exact date. But there was something very similar on the Lollyberry. Um, it's got some pin tucks, I believe, right? Or maybe, oh yeah, on the bottoms there's some pin tuck kind of layering and then there's like these ruffle layerings and they're really cute and in the back there's waist ties and it's fully sheared and I've never actually had a fully sheared dress before so that's going to be really comfortable and nice and I love I love the little heart buttons that's so cute 
um there was supposed to be like a white spot they said i think it's just this um i'm pretty positive that'll come off in the wash so i'm not really worried about it and the best thing about this too is this detachable collar it's so cute it's so adorable i love this collar so much it's gonna this collar is so cute just to even like wear like with this turtleneck like that is so cute i can't i'm so happy i love detachable collars and like outside of lolita and so it's awesome to have one in lolita i'm so happy with this it's so cute i'll i i will insert me wearing it um but yeah it matches like so well with this so it's it, i'm so happy with that okay now and it matches with uskumia so cute okay now we can put it right here because this is a gift for Usakumiya as well. She's gonna sit like that. <laughs> this is also a gift for Usakumiya. I feel like I'm announcing a pregnancy or something. Sorry, I'm like playing with my hair because it's been crazy. But yeah, I feel like I'm now announcing a pregnancy. I'm not pregnant. I don't plan on getting that way for at least a very long time. So not putting that in the universe. But I say that because I ordered a Kumia Kumia, so Uza Kumia is gonna have a sibling, so I'm excited. Let me open this up properly, if I can. I didn't just get an, a Kumia Kumia, but I also got, oh, I'm doing this a, such a poor job at opening these, but whatever. No box. Okay, so I got a Baby the Starshine Bright and Angel, or not Angel. Alice in the Pirates bag. I'm gonna just like fold that right back up. I personally do not like their new bags. I know most people don't. They're just so plain. I hate that. I really want, I really wanted like more iconic bags. Cause you know, let's be real. This one's way more iconic. Also the material is like a lot nicer than this bag. This bag like, cr like it crinkles. I mean, that one crinkles too, but this one like is like a paper crinkle. And so I feel like it just, it's even worse. <gasps> Look at how it's decorated. That's so cute. I mean, I know that like I, you can see in this video up there that I also unboxed her, but um, this is done so cute. I didn't, they like put her in like a little gift box thing, gift bag. Oh, that's so cute. I don't think they did that for that one. I think they just, like, wrapped her in, um, the Baby Distortion Bright bag. So this is really cute. I was kind of curious on how they, like, put her in that box that I got. Because I think the other one came in a longer box. So I have this little Baby Distortion Bright tie. I'm keeping that. I don't care if that that's just trash, but I'm keeping it. Oh, I should have taken a picture of that. Hold on a second. <laughs> Okay, sorry for the angle changing. I just wanted to record that for TikTok. So let's go back into unboxing this. Should've done that for the other stuff too, but whatever, I'll take it. Okay, so this is why Baby is superior to me than AP because when you order something from Baby, I mean, I've never, I've only ordered this from Baby before, so I can't say much. And then this is my second order, but they give you a very sweet postcard like that is so cute it's their newest collection um or the newest like biggest print collection i don't remember what it's called i'm really bad at remembering prints but i really liked this um this collection that they did the print is just so pretty and adorable and uh, it's so cute i'm not one for prints but this is a very cute print i like how like it's it's simple but not and I like how it's an overall print and I I just love cookie prints. I think they're cute. So yeah. <laughs> um and then of course a Baby the Starshine Bright logo sticker, which I'm so happy I have another one of these now because that means like I could probably use this one. I don't know because I I don't know. I don't I wanna keep them because they're sacred. But <laughs> I don't know where I'm even gonna put it because um I don't even use a laptop anymore, so I don't know. I have no idea. I'm really bad at putting stickers on things because I, I always feel like I can't put stickers on, like, electronics or something. But I digress. I'm sorry. I'm rambling. So, oh, you can see, you can see the comia peeking out of the pink wrapping. 
Are you ex oh, I took her down. I was coming, I was talking to her while she's over here. There you go. Are you excited, Usukomiya? There's a birth happening right now. I hate how I have to tear the paper, but whatever. It's just pink wrapping paper. Ah, she's being birthed. Ah, so cute. It's so cute. <laughs> okay, so this is my Komakomya. Oh, so soft. So soft, it's a Komya. I mean, you're soft too, of course, but like this is brand new soft and I mean, you're not that old and I haven't really taken you out all that much because I, I worry about her safety. She's like very stain attraction. She, I don't have a stain on her, thank God, but I'm just saying white. I'm surprised that I haven't stained you because that scares me. So <laughs> they're together now. Oh, how cute are they? I'm so, okay, wait, I wanted to do this so badly. So let's make them, let's make them hold hands. Oh, oh, wrong attraction. Okay, sorry. That was the wrong one that they, okay. Now they hold hands. I feel like that's odd though. They're holding the wrong kinds of hands. Let's do this way. <laughs> okay, it kind of doesn't work because the opposite ones, <laughs> you have to do it this way. <laughs> But that's okay. They can do some weird spooning action, I guess. But look at how cute. Oh, they are so cute together. One day I will have, well, yeah, no, for sure I will have the black one too with like the um, navy ribbons. I was actually going to get that one originally. I was okay with getting a Komakomia with just the like coin purse kind of top. And that was like only like $70, so they're like pretty reasonable. And it was on there like in November and I really considered getting it. But I was like, no, I want the black one first. The black Usakumia. Um, and then the black one came up. But then so did the Komakumia. And I thought about it more and I was like, you know, really? The Komakumia goes with like literally everything. Whereas the black Usakumia with the navy only goes with like certain stuff that I have. I mean, it goes with a decent amount of stuff I have. But this goes with like everything because it's just a plain brown teddy bear. So that's why I was like, okay, I'll get him. <laughs> but yeah, he's so soft. I feel like almost, I don't know, it's weird because like Usukomiya is soft, but like not as soft as Kumakomiya. And I don't know if that's just because I had her for like half a year now, but oh. But I haven't really taken her out. I mean, I've, I've had her like sitting, sitting out, um, just hanging out, but like, yeah, he's so much softer than my Usukomiya. So I'm like, ooh, should I be like brushing her or something? Cause what the fuck? I mean, she's definitely still soft, but like, this is insane. I talk too much, I'm sorry. But yeah, so this is my, my kumakumia. I got the brown, um, the like classic brown ribbons. I think that the like milk tea um, brown like flowers are really cute for the ribbons as well. But I liked this one cause it's classic. I feel like the, new, the other ones like are more newer like, thing and I feel like it fits well with like the Hime Lolita stuff and my stuff isn't really like that so I, I went with the classic brown. Um, I don't know if he got sold out or something really fast because he's not even on the website anymore whereas like all the other ones are but they also had the Usukumia that was they marked as sold out. They just, he's just gone. I don't know what happened to him but yeah. <laughs> um, he comes with the brown straps which are like the, the, the straps are amazing um, and he's got the little bear ears. And just like Uzukumia, he is, this is a bonnet. So, look, the little bear. I don't know why you wear a bear bonnet when you are a bear. I know why Uzukumia wears rabbit ears, but, <laughs> um, but yeah, so cute. So then you open it up right here. It's like a little zipper. And then the interior, which is just brown. Uzukumiya says pink. Um, I would just show you how my phone fits in it. I got, I recently got a new phone. I got the iPhone 13 and it fits perfectly in the Uzukumiya. So I'm sure it fits him too um, in the pouchettes. So I was very happy about that because uh, the iPhone 13 is slightly smaller than the iPhone XRs with what I had before. So it's awesome to be able to actually kind of use it. <laughs> 
instead of just have it as like decoration essentially the bows are so cute too um yeah the lace everything oh, it's so soft i feel like bad because i feel like my my utsukomiya wasn't that soft but um so then they have magnetic hands which is my favorite part about the komias they have little magnetic hands those magnets okay there you go his magnets are not as strong i think as my usukomiya's magnets they're definitely there they're not as strong whereas this one's like immediately it clasps so that's a little interesting and yep they don't have the like joints like the mini rucksack and the rucksack ones but they're still really cute has a little baby logo right here and the baby tag oh it's so cute i love the baby tag so much and then that was the price um yeah, I'm very happy with him. And then the other thing I got were these wrist cuffs. And originally I really wanted, um, I really wanted to get a pair of uh, socks, but the socks sold out very fast. So I was like, you know what, since I'm ordering something already, I should get something else. And the wrist cuffs were available. So the wrist cuffs is what I got. And they're very sweet. I really like them a lot. They only had, or they didn't have the all white ones, which I was fine with. I mean, I also got the Majoli Shop um, wrist cuffs. She get, she made me a pair of wrist cuffs for my birthday, and they're all white, so that was awesome. Um, and these just fit perfectly in my wardrobe too, because I obviously wear a lot of black and white. So I got these, and here's a little. Oh, is it the same? Yeah, okay. Little baby tag. I just I love the baby tag, and that was the price wasn't too bad for since I'm already ordering something I figured I'd get something else so yeah that's the end of my haul sorry I like dragged that out for so long I talk way too much but I hope you enjoyed unboxing with me and see you soon bye